On the 2nd of February, we celebrate the feast of the presentation of our Lord Jesus Christ. The following are some thoughts on this special day in the life of our church. Many years before the coming of Christ, there lived a very pious and saintly man called Simeon. He was one of the most intelligent Jewish scholars of his day. He was called upon by the ruler of the land to assist in translating the books of the Old Testament. It was during this time that he learnt of the coming of the Messiah, as foretold by the prophets of Israel. Simeon soon found himself praying for the day that the Saviour would come and deliver all Israel and the world from sin. Simeon waited for many years, and finally one evening as he knelt in prayer, he heard the voice of God saying to him that he would not die until he had seen the Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. Simeon was filled with great joy and fervently prayed each day that the Messiah would soon come to the world. Holy tradition tells us that Simeon waited many long years. Some holy fathers inform us that Simeon was over 150 years old when the promise of God was fulfilled. Others say that he waited over 200 years. The Bible tells us that finally, on February the 2nd, 40 days after the birth of Jesus Christ, the Virgin Mary brought the Christ child to the temple for presentation. It was common Jewish practice to bring the firstborn male child to the temple and to offer him to the service of the Lord. It was here that Simeon waited patiently that day, as he had done for so many years. The Spirit of the Lord brought him to the baby Jesus. Simeon took the infant child in his trembling hands and recited the following beautiful prayer which, was, which is recited in the Orthodox Church every evening during the Vesper services. Lord, now let your servant depart in peace according to your promise, because my eyes have seen your salvation which you have prepared in the presence of all people, a light shown to the Gentiles and for glory to your people Israel. Thus the promise of the aged Simeon was finally fulfilled. He did live to see the Messiah as God had promised. The next day Simeon died in peace, thankful to the Almighty God that he was honoured to see the coming of Christ. All this occurred on February the 2nd, 40 days after the birth of Christ. This feast day is called the Presentation of Our Lord at the Temple. This Jewish tradition of presenting children at the Temple is still practised in the Orthodox Church. If the child which is being presented is a male child, it is brought into the altar in the hope that someday he will serve Christ as a priest. A female child is brought only to the entrance of the altar, since they do not serve as priests in the Orthodox Church. The very same prayers are read for both male and female children. The service ends with the ancient and beautiful prayer of Saint Simeon.